I've been told I have a great imagination. When I was young, I told my friends stories upon stories of fantastical realms of magic and fairies where we saved those in need. But imagination comes with a price. I see my sister screaming at the rain that's falling too fast. She sits in a hospital bed because the meds couldn't slow down the rain and she wanted to catch every drop. I never saw it. And yet I can't help but picture tangled brown hair against white sheets staring up at the ceiling that's threatening to crush her. Classmates wondering where she's gone. What could possibly have extinguished this girl of fire? I was too young to understand. And so was she. I see my best friend. She stands in her red tiled kitchen cleaning dishes while the rest of her family sleeps. All is quiet and there's a knife to her chest. She puts the knife back in its place as though it had been there from the beginning and walks back to her room of glass, always watched but never seen. She says I was the reason she put down the knife. I am too naive to understand because I am not a girl of fire. I am a girl of stories. In reality, I can't save them and imagination comes with a price. With it, I see suffering, but without it, I see nothing at all.